How Bogom moths navigate to places they've never seen. Let's play an orientation game. You start at a rural location at night. Your task is to find a specific cave you've never seen, 1000 kilometers away, without map or compass. How would you do? For Bogong moths, that's just another Tuesday. These moths hatch in Australia's lowlands. In early summer, they migrate to the snowy mountains, escaping the heat in cool alpine caves before returning in autumn to breed. Some fly over 1000 kilometers, comparable to hiking from Paris to Madrid, and they have never seen their destination before. So how do they manage to find it? To figure this out, scientists placed moths in a specially designed flight simulator. They blocked Earth's magnetic field to rule out its influence. Then they projected a realistic night sky onto a dome. The moths set off in their migratory direction. When researchers rotated the star pattern, the moths adjusted their direction accordingly. This is the first clear evidence that invertebrates can use the night sky for long distance navigation, a rare skill previously known only in a few migratory birds and of course, humans. But what if the night is cloudy? Fortunately, bogong moths have a backup. They can also use Earth's magnetic field to navigate. That's why it had to be blocked to reveal their celestial navigation skills. Scientists are still working out which feature of the night sky guides them. Their vision isn't sharp enough to pick out individual stars, but they see the sky much brighter than we do. So a likely candidate is the glowing band of the Milky Way. And we sometimes struggle to find a parked car just a block away.